Okay. For Blacks and, Blacks and Hollywood.com, I'm DC Libraries. We're here live at the Beacon. We're just talking to a few people about patty pie. You know, we all have had a sweet potato pie from time from time to time. Right. But what's your favorite um, soul food? Like, if you were able to have dinner right now with the OJs and um, Gladys Knight, what would you like them to make for you? Well, I hear Gladys makes a mean mac and cheese. <laughs> If you fry up some chicken, I'm actually yeah. looking forward to yeah. doing uh, an advocate of diabetes because she's an advocate of diabetes. So we really like that's why I'm really looking forward to talking to her because we like to do a celebration of life regarding diabetes and being an advocate and a voice to the people to celebrate life and not ignore the deadly you know aspects of diabetes. Well, that brings me to my next question, I'll which is again. we're launching the Black Food Channel later this Food year. Obviously, we got to make sure that we have a diabetes factor there. Yeah, you got to. Um, what's, what's a show that you would like to see on the Black Food Channel? Like, What's something that, that would be on there that you might want to watch? On the Food Channel? Yeah, so? we're going to launch the Black Food Channel later this year. Um, what kind of content? Healthy. healthy food. Eating healthy. The real, I mean, what is really eating healthy? You know, what appeals to some don't appeal to everybody. What affects it? Food affects people differently. So I would think that a food channel that's thorough, authentic, and has a good understanding of how we can eat better. You know, not so much healthy, but eat better. better. I'm glad that we have teamed up with the black farmers to do exactly that. So I'm glad that you mentioned that. Yeah, it's important, man. It's so important. We're here live in New York City, so stay tuned. We'll be looking at hashtag all night long, Gladys Night. You can yes. follow that hashtag. You can always go to Blacks in Hollywood to learn more about tonight's concert.